Hello, this is Mrs. Hink, and let's talk mass. So, mass is the measure of the amount of matter inside of an object. This right here is a triple beam balance, because there are three beams, and this is used to measure mass. So if we put something on here, we're measuring against the balance of these triple beams and the weights that are on top of them. The first one is a screw. So what you wanna do is you wanna make sure that your triple beam balance measures out at zero. Right here, this little line is gonna match up with this little line. We're good, it's perfect. So I'm going to set this in the center of the triple beam balance and you will notice a change. So this is heavier than zero grams. So you want to start on this very, very bottom one. I'm going to move this up very close, as close as I can. And we want to move this until we notice a change like that. So we're waiting for the weight to balance out on this triple beam balance. Still a little bit heavier. The screw is a little bit heavier. So we're going to keep going just a little bit. I should say it has more mass now. So you've got to wait and have a lot of patience for it to balance out. Sometimes it's not by much, but you've got to move it. That looks pretty, pretty even. What do you think? So reading our triple beam balance, this, this smallest one goes from zero to 10. And then in between, as I accidentally bump it, there are 10 lines in between each. So this one measures at six and two tenths grams. Six and two tenths grams. Let's see, how about this bouncy ball? Let's see if we can get it to sit in the middle of this tray. Look at that, look at that. <laughs> All right, so we start at the very beginning with the single digit numbers. It looks like this bouncy ball has quite a lot more mass than the last object. What do you think? More? Ooh, you can't even see it. Here we go, there we go. Just a little bit, a little bit more. So this went all the way to 10, which means we have to bring it all the way back to the beginning and then we're gonna jump to the back bar because this one counts by tens, okay? So we're gonna start at 10. We're gonna start at 10 because we know that 10 was not enough mass to balance out our triple beam balance. So it seems like we still have a little bit to go and instead of continuing to go by tens, I wanna go by ones again. So just like going from nine, 10, 11, that's what we're doing here. We have 10 in the back and then each single digit number here would be like counting up by ones again. All right, so it is just over 10 grams, I would say. Oh, that's pretty good. Almost. All right, what do you think? We good? So let's read it. We've got 10 and one, two, three, four, 10 and four hundredths. 10 and 4 tenths, 10 and 4 tenths, sorry about that. 10 and 4 tenths grams. This bouncy ball is 10 and 4 tenths grams. Got to reset, 10 and 4 tenths grams. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.